Televisions can be found everywhere, and are impossible to avoid. As the most consumed medium, the TV is a very significant invention that has become an absolute necessity for some. In 1927, Vladimir Zarigin, a Russian immigrant, developed a circuit for transforming a visual image into an electronic signal. Around the same time, Philo T. Farmsworth, an American inventor, completed a working model of a similar system and soon applied for a patent. A year later, RCA, an American electronics company, paid Farnsworth $1 million for the rights to his patent. Successful color television began broadcasting in 1953, with cable television also beginning at the same time. Remote controls also entered American homes in 1956 after Zenith Electronics Corporation released their Lazy Bones model. Uh, do you consider TV to be an important part of your life or our life? I think it's an important part of my life. It acts as company for for me sometimes, and gives me a lot of information, you know, about particular、uh, subjects like the History Channel or the Science Channel.、Um, and then, of course, we just want to be entertained. <laughs> like my favorite is the Sci-Fi、uh, Channel. So, yeah, I think so. I, I think that people look for to TV and their computers now and look for streaming. You know, as part of your life, as part of communication. Do you consider TV to be an important important part of your daily life? No, I don't consider it to be important, but I think it's nice to come home to and just space out and watch it. Kind of therapeutic in its own way. Do you consider TV to be an important part of your daily life? Um, I don't think it's really that important. I think it's more of a luxury. Yeah. yeah, it's nice to come home and watch TV and not think about your day,、yeah. but it's not a necessity.、Yeah. For you yourself, how much do you consume TV like weekly? Weekly on a weekly basis, probably、uh, maybe about three hours a night, depending on what the show is, like Criminal Minds or、uh, the new、uh, CSI Cyber. Um, or、uh, something on one of the like premium channels, like Penny Dreadfuls, you know. So if it's really interesting, you know, then I'll watch it. Do you think Americans in general consume too much television? <clears throat> um. Yes and no. I think there's some people that that's all they do. They kind of takes over their lives, and they're not very productive because of it. And then I know people that don't watch any TV at all, so it, it's hard to say. Television offers us a wide variety of programs and content that has proven to be significant to people in their daily lives. TV entertains, educates, and even inspires some people. TV has shown to be a positive contribution to society and will continue to have significance and relevance for decades to come.